morning everyone it's Annika welcome to or back to my channel today's video is going to be a few days in my life today I am off from work so I have the entire day to myself so I woke up at 9 um, and it's currently like 10 right now but I've just been tidying my apartment for the past like hour and I'm about to go walk Lola. Um, I'm also trying not to be upset at the fact that I'm not up at 7 a.m. Like I could feel my body getting burned out. So whenever you feel your body telling you to slow down, you definitely need to listen to it. Kind of pace myself, take it slower. I have a few errands to get done too. <laughs> And this is like my work from home cardigan that I love. It's from Target and it's like a skims dupe. So every time I'm working from home, I put it on because it just makes me feel so cozy and comfortable. I also just made myself some breakfast. I made a little sandwich and it has some smashed avocado and then like a potato and egg white scramble with some garlic powder and some chili flakes and Cholula. This is like my favorite savory breakfast sandwich to make so i'm just gonna eat this while i plan out my day and recently i have been planning my days on google calendar so this is kind of what it looks like i love how like i can color code everything and just have it here and like edit it as i go so i will still write down like the actual tasks in my agenda and i also use my agenda for like the monthly calendar but when it comes to like day to day and like the actual times that i'm going to do things i just find this like way more efficient and i saw a video about this on youtube which is what actually inspired me to do this so i'm going to link that down below the girl was just kind of explaining like how to budget your time in your day like you would your money and i thought it was really smart and helpful <laughs> out to run my errands earlier than usual but before i leave i just wanted to show you my outfit because i thought it was pretty cute it's all lululemon and i bought these at like completely different times but it ended up becoming like this really cute matching set but i know that lulu can be a little bit expensive so i'm gonna link down below tala which is a brand by grace beverly if you know her and they literally make this exact set but for cheaper because you can literally get this look but for less okay guys we're in the middle of running errands i just dropped off some clothes to donate and now i am going to go to best buy to look at some pc laptops for day trading before we go there i'm gonna stop at duncan because i ran out of almond milk at my apartment which is terrible so i couldn't make my coffee this morning name a better sound so I just left Best Buy and I think I found a laptop that I'm gonna take, which is awesome. I'm gonna order it for pickup right now, but while they prepare that, I came over to the container store cause it's like right across from Best Buy. <laughs> Just made myself a salad with some of last night's leftover salmon for lunch. It is currently 4 15. I have been working for like the past two and a half hours. Now I'm going to go and do some upper body in the gym downstairs. And I started doing Natasha Ocean's new build guide, which I'm loving so far. If you are into fitness or want someone to follow, I highly, highly recommend her. 
she's so authentic and her workouts are really functional and mobile so i love that because it really makes me feel toned beyond just weightlifting and this is what i'm wearing to the gym i'm wearing this brown lululemon align top and these cream colored aloe like spandex shorts with my nike lifting shoes <laughs> just showered and got all cozy for the evening and renee is coming over right now because we need to go run a few errands and get some stuff for dinner but while i wait i am going to try this light stim device that i bought it's like a blue light device to help acne but i just want to try this anyways and see if it works Got some pokey for dinner. Looks so good. And some boba. office right now it's 8 15 and i have to be there at 8 30 but first i'm just picking up some coffee today i only work a half day i only work till noon which is super nice because i get the rest of the day to myself so let's head in and get our coffee <music> I just got out of work. It is 12.30 and I am tired. I think I am getting a sinus infection because my sinuses and my ears and my head are like all messed up. But anyways, it was a good day. Just sent out some samples of a new product to a panel for testing. And then we also, well, I was logging some competitive products in a sheet and that literally took up my whole morning, so I just did those two things. Now I am gonna go get some food. So my friend wanted to do a little pool day at my apartment, but I'm not feeling the greatest. My sinuses have just been really bothering me these past two days. I also just feel like I have so much work and like so many things to work on, but then I'm trying to find like a balance in my life between like work and play because I feel like I can be really narrowed in on just work which isn't good for me all the time so but anyways right now let's just go get some ingredients for lunch and then head home Editing. Oh my gosh, don't look at my sink. <laughs>
going to get ready for bed. We went to Salada and got some really good salads for dinner. We also worked out, which you saw a little bit of, and that was really nice. It was leg day, so it was challenging. I started using a few new products, so I'm giving them a few weeks to see how they work. First, I am going to put on this Is Clinical Active Serum, and it's supposed to be really good to help control acne. I also started using the Rode Peptide Glazing Fluid. I'm pretty sure everyone has heard about this. I started using it about a week ago and so far I love the texture of it. But I don't want to tell you my final thoughts because I want to give it some more time to work before I decide if it's made like a huge difference in my skin or not. So I'm just checking in to update that it's been a few weeks now when I'm editing this and I can say that I really like how hydrating but also thin and lightweight the serum is on my skin. I feel like it has made a difference in keeping my skin really hydrated when I incorporate it as an extra step into my skincare routine. So I think it's a really good option for a hydrating serum to add either into your night routine or if you have dry skin like me to use it twice a day and I've really been loving it so far. My skin hasn't had any bad reactions to it and I have really sensitive skin, so that is a good sign. I also started using the Rode Peptide Lip Treatment and I am obsessed with it. It is the best lip mask hydrating lip treatment that I have tried. It seriously keeps my lips so hydrated and like smooth for hours, longer than any other product that I've used. So if you can get your hands on it, I would highly recommend this. I wish it came in a bigger size though, because I feel like I'm gonna run out of this really quickly. But besides that, it is so perfect. And I have the watermelon flavor. in bed now i just took my vitamins and i'm feeling good i am going to edit a little bit and then just go to sleep but that is the end of this video i hope you enjoyed coming along with me for the past few days and just hanging out with me and if you like videos like this and want to see more then make sure to like and subscribe it means a lot to me thank you so much for watching and i will see you in my next video <laughs>